Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I have a really small, quick haul to share with you guys. Right now, Michaels has all of their like stickers and a lot of their embellishments, planners, and accessories on clearance. So I was able to pick up some stickers and some embellishments uh, for Michaels. Everything I got was $1 and under. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. Definitely check out your local Michaels store to see if they're having clearance sales. I know it's uh, the Christmas season and holidays, but I could definitely do some, um, you know, hoarding uh, for embellishments and stuff for like springtime, which is what I picked up. So, let me stop talking and go ahead and get into what I found. So, first, I found these really cute dimensional stickers. And they're like, um, kind of like rosette butterflies. And they're by Recollections. I got three packs. And this is what they look like. And these will be really pretty, um... As embellishments on some um, some of the rosettes that I like to make, whether it be paper or crepe paper rosettes uh, or scrapbook paper rosettes, y'all know if y'all watched uh, some of my embellishment videos, the rosettes that I like to make, and I like them to be really chunky and dimensional, and I think these will be really really pretty on top. So I picked up three of these, and these were only a dollar a piece. So, I just think they'll be really good for springtime. Or, I could probably get away with using these for Valentine's as well. With the pink, I have the mint green in there. So, I got three of those. Only a dollar. I also picked up these uh, dimensional flowers with the little bling piece in the center. And they're white. I could always use some color spray and color them if I want but I like them like this and I could actually add some glitter if I want to just dress them up a little bit these were only 50 cent and these are um, recollections as well and I have four packs so um, 50 cent a piece really great so I'll either be using these um, to embellish some projects or maybe giving away in Happy Meal, something. But for 50 cent, I thought that was a really good deal. I also found some of these Recollections Bling stickers is what they're called, but they are like little enamel, um, little enamel dots. And these are some really pretty spring, summer colors. So I picked up two of those. They were only a dollar a piece. I really wish they had like some red, green, and gold for Christmas time, but I got what I could get. So those were only a dollar. I found these really pretty dimensional butterfly embellishment stickers, and these are like metallic gold and glitter. I got three packs of these. Really pretty. Hopefully the glare from the paper is not too much for y'all but really pretty so I got three packs of those and I like getting little clearance items like this because if I don't use them for projects these are great for you know giving away as just extra little goodies in swap uh, in swaps and things like that so I thought these was really pretty. They'll be great embellishments for anything. And um, also great goodies to give away. So good for Happy Meal. All right. So also I got these Jolie's Boutique. Um, these are little uh, timepieces, little clocks. And um, these are the vintage pocket watches. So these are a steal because usually I think these probably run the two to three dollar, probably the three dollar range if you're not getting them on clearance. And they were only a dollar a piece. So I picked up three of those. Really nice. Really nice. 
And these are going to be great embellishments for something. Um, these little time pieces work really good for masculine projects as well. Specifically like Father's Day or, you know, masculine cards um, and, you know, scrapbooking. So I did pick up three of those. They were only a dollar. Also, I found these really pretty, um, like, I think it's, um, I think it's enamel or epoxy, um, but these are little, I don't know if it's enamel or epoxy flowers, really pretty spring, summer, if you can see that. I got three packs of these. These are really nice embellishments for anything as well and really nice goodies to give away uh, but so I got three of those okay. and then y'all know I love thickers even though I rarely show you guys how I use the thickers um, so I have quite a big collection of thickers but I do use them um, not as much as I should but I do use them and so anytime I could find a really good deal on thickers I go ahead and get them and I, I used to get most of my thickers from Tuesday morning because they always always carry them but now I think since the pandemic um the stores are a little bit different especially Tuesday morning my Tuesday morning in my area that used to have everything is like barely carrying anything and it seems like the prices went up on the scrapbooking supplies there so i found these at michael's and i was so happy to find these because they were all only one dollar a piece so i got these silver um foil thickers and these are the lowercase also have the numbers yeah I also got this one this is the jewel box uh, bubble gum glitter stickers the pretty pink I got two packs of those I love that font so only a dollar and then this one is the rain boots and um, it's like that teal that pretty teal glitter and these are really, really good for scrapbooking layouts, um, but also to personalize gifts and cards as well. So that is my little haul. I just wanted to share with you guys in case you want to check out your Michaels if you hadn't already. Uh, and they do have a lot. And if you're into planners, they have a lot a lot of planner items on clearance I really didn't need any planner items and I was like trying to think about who I might be able to buy a planner and some planner accessories for Christmas but I just wasn't sure so I just left the planner stuff there because y'all know I like my happy planner and um I like to do my layouts in my happy planner and those planners that were on clearance at Michaels I believe are the kind of like the ring binder planners by recollections but they have some really nice ones some leather bound ones that you just refill whenever you need and they had all of the pages and accessories for those on sale on clearance so definitely check that out if that's something you guys like but um and also, I wanted to let y'all know that I did not get a good start on my December daily. Okay, I did probably day one. I think I did day three. I still have pictures that I need to print for in between days. But my December daily will definitely not be every day in December. Like I wished. It just won't. So... I it's gonna be hit and miss but I am definitely gonna try to document the most important memories um, of this month 
I'm definitely going to stick with it. I got kind of down a little bit and I just wasn't feeling it. And But now I'm like trying to get myself back in the, you know, mood um, so that I can get back on track. But I will definitely do my December daily walkthrough with you guys just to show you how it turned out and um, what what I did, um, what I liked and what I didn't like. I'll come back and do a share with you guys for that and um, some ideas that I have going forward because I did get a bad start I'm not gonna lie I had every intention on being up on my December daily and documenting and everything but man I'm, I'm telling y'all like I you know if y'all watched I attempted to do a live card making session and that didn't go well at all I did a supersized card with my sign and set stamp joyful season kit hopefully y'all will go check that out if you haven't already um, it just showed a good way to use up those large images on the six by eight papers that come in those kits without having to cut them down you can still make cards with them without having to cut them down so that's what was my idea for that uh, let's see what else um, I do plan on doing some more cards and it'll probably be pre-recorded because I definitely want to do another live session. I just need to make sure my Wi-Fi is strong and maybe I should film probably when everybody here is either gone or off of the wi-fi because everybody here in my household it's uh my husband myself and all of the children we have four kids everybody have laptops and ipads and cell phones and everybody is connected to the wi-fi so i was thinking well maybe that is what interfered with the live i'm not sure but I'm definitely going to figure it out and then come on and do another live session because I really do want like interacting with you guys and meeting new people here um, in the crafty world. So yeah, I don't really want to make this a long video, but I know I'm just rambling, but I just wanted to kind of catch you guys up and let you know that yes, I am still doing December daily, even though... I have not been in the mood at all. I just lost the Christmas holiday spirit for a hot minute, but I'm trying to get myself back into it. I feel like it's a stress boost, uh, a stress buster when I am crafting. So I just need to get myself back in the mood, get back in here and do some crafting and just get over it. Um, so stay tuned for my next video and it'll probably be making some christmas cards i think i've already made all of the christmas cards that i am going to be giving out and sending out um which i will probably start sending them out next weekend um so that they can be where they need to be for christmas um but i've i, I still wanted to have so much paper I still wanted to make some and maybe I can make some put them away so that I can have a, a jump off for the next season so yeah that is it guys if you like this video please give me a thumbs up um, if you're not subscribed to my channel and you would like to subscribe just hit the red subscribe button uh, turn on your notifications which is that little bell click on that little bell so you'll know whenever I upload a new video or have some new content um, and uh, feel free to comment below um, I definitely want to uh, interact with you guys more and uh, just get some crafty friends together where we can maybe swap uh, different crafts and um, do some swaps and stuff. I've been enjoying joining swaps and um, meeting new people here. So that is going to be my goal in this upcoming year to to do that. Okay. So yeah, let me just let y'all go and say goodbye for now. 
and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.